game, so like a patient knows like during a seizure or during surgery. We call ourselves an MST or mobile surgical team. It really involves uh, a group of various individuals, uh, myself, a CRNA, uh, two operating room nurses, and tech technicians, OR technicians, that come along together, packing up our gear and our operating room equipment into a compact way so we can transport it from point A to point B, perform surgeries in conjunction with local national hospitals, physicians, and then return back to our base and enable us to perform these in a kind of expeditionary fashion. Well, these uh, are a, a perfect opportunity to rehearse that by allowing the team to configure, uh, pack, deploy, set up in a matter of a couple hours in a new setting that they haven't seen before, like they would do in a disaster situation. In this particular case, we're set up in Danli, El Paraiso. There's a lot of backlog and uh, the waiting list is huge for all these surgical patients. We do primarily general surgery uh, that any, involves anything from hernia repairs, excision of lipomas, to gallbladder surgery, gallbladder removal. Uh, we've done an amputation today, which uh, basically is not very commonplace, but vascular disease is present in this country. And as a vascular surgeon, I'd like to be able to contribute my expertise to helping those folks with vascular disease, as well as any other surgical issue that may arise within you know, the limits of my capabilities and ours as a team. And our goal is to continue to evolve and to pack it into smaller size units that we can transport in a much easier fashion. As an MST, we've traveled through Central America and several countries as well as throughout the country of Honduras. We are able to you know, hopefully help them and you know, give them you know, a better chance at life and health overall. We are the partners.